So we have Patrick here, CEO and founder of Endmaker. Welcome and uh, congratulations actually on the award yesterday for the developer tools. It's, it's great to have you. Thank you very much and thanks for having me. It's great to see you again. Yeah, yeah uh, so what do you think about all this? Honestly, I, I'm very surprised at how good it is. Like the event, in, in my opinion, is, is extremely high quality and the foundation really went all out. So I'm, yeah. I'm very happy. Yeah. I didn't expect it to be like this, this I don't know, just clean. Big, yeah. I'm, big. yeah, it looks like a lot of, I, I don't know, I cannot, I don't see a project that is not here. That is very true. I mean, there are a lot of uh, NFT projects uh, yeah. missing, but like from the DeFi space and, and the like, um, more serious business space of, of Cardano, it's like everyone's here. Yeah, it's yeah, really yeah. cool. And uh, since you're NFT, tell me, tell me, tell me more about the Endmaker things you do. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so uh, I mean, Endmaker is about making Cardano accessible, right? Because Cardano is very difficult to develop on. So what we do is we essentially focus on creating tools for other people to actually launch their own NFT collections, launch their own web-free products, stuff like that. And, um, and we're really like pushing on that. So we really try to make it as easy as possible. So we are building a lot of tools and especially like for me, the, the onboarding part is important. So like new users coming into the space and that, that's very difficult right now because you have to go to an exchange, you have to yep. buy crypto, download Nami wallet, etc. All that stuff. It's way too way too complicated for like normal users, right? But so what with you? Yeah, with you. Like with, with us, we try to, to make that easier and we're already at a good point, I think, where it's quite easy to do, but we are um, settling down on that more and mm -hmm. we are building a custodial wallet oh. um, which will be integrated into Endmaker Pay so people can buy uh, the NFT with a credit card and immediately get a wallet and that's going to be their first entry point and then afterwards they can still you know switch to like a non-custodial wallet like NAMI etc. That, sound, that sounds great so uh, do we have any dates or something? Q something? I don't have any dates no, it's a no. very difficult topic but there are many things coming and mm -hmm. it's like a process uh, because we have to have the account system first and so on but yeah, it, I don't have a specific date. Okay, but big big things coming on. Uh, and you're also uh, part of uh, Genius X. Uh, you're one of the advisors. So do you have anything to say about it since yep, we're the biggest accelerator on the Cardano at the moment? Yeah, I mean, I, I, I love what Genius X is doing because uh, Genius X is really helping new startups launch into the space and giving them the support that they need. And uh, and there, there has been a lack of that from the beginning. So now we finally have something who's, who's doing that. And um, for me specifically, that means that people or projects rather in Genius X can actually reach out to me. And then we, you know, figure out, okay, how can I help them? Is there something where we can, can collaborate on and so on? And that has happened multiple times now, actually. Um, I also met some projects here, like, mm -hmm. like Martify or Mesh, yeah, yeah. Um, which I think is an amazing project, honestly. Uh, very, very underrated. So, you know, I'm trying to figure out, okay, like, how can I work with these people? Because I truly believe you have to collaborate with everyone to grow the space. And you cannot just build in a box. We're not exactly. Web2. We, can't, yeah. we cannot run a business like Web2. We have to talk to everyone. We have to share ideas and so on. Thank you for the contribution and actually for, for joining me. You're very welcome.